Hello, I am Ajay Tyagi, the Portfolio Manager of UTI FlexiCap Fund. Let me start by reiterating the core philosophy of UTI FlexiCap. Like we have always maintained, the fund invests into strong businesses which have the ability to create economic value in the long run. We have always believed in the fact that sustainable wealth creation for investors can essentially be done by identifying and then staying invested into businesses that have the ability to create economic value year after year sustainably for a very long period of time. It is because of this that in UTI FlexiCap Fund, we choose one of the strongest companies from a few sectors, essentially sectors that have demonstrated in the past the ability to create shareholder wealth. And then very patiently, we stick on to these companies for a very long period. This is something which is reflected in our very low portfolio turnover ratio. In fact, ever since this phase of correction started since January of 2022, you would have also noticed that there is no change that we have made in the portfolio. There are no exits that have been made from the portfolio, essentially because we feel each and every company that we are holding in is fairly resilient, is strong, has a very strong balance sheet, has strong cash flow generation and therefore has the ability to withstand the present crisis that is unfolding globally. We also want to uh, reiterate the fact that while we choose out great companies and hold on to them patiently, there is no guarantee that the stock prices of these companies would behave in a particular manner quarter after quarter. In fact, many a times, these great businesses themselves go through difficult times, particularly in terms of stock price behavior, but that itself can never be the reason to actually exit these companies or to basically prune down exposure in these companies. Our thinking is usually contra, which basically means that whenever great businesses are going through challenges in terms of stock prices, we try and actually increase exposure into these very businesses. Let me give you an example of a company that we have been holding on for a very, very long time in our portfolio. This company is called Hevels India, which is basically one of the leader in consumer durables in the country. If you look at the performance of this company in terms of its stock price over the last 10 years, it's delivered 25% CAGR, 25% annualized return. But in order to really attain this 25% annualized return, you had to actually endure periods of very sharp corrections which have happened every few years in the last decade. So just like the present day when Havels has uh, seen a correction of about 25 or 26 percent in the last six months, back in 2013 and in 2015 and in 2016, also in 2018 and finally in 2020, it went through a similar or a higher than 25 percent correction and yet for patient investors has delivered very strong double digit annualized returns. And that to my mind is the most essential skill. Once you've identified a great business, you really have to stick on to it very, very patiently rather than getting influenced by changing market moves. And this is exactly what we're trying to do with UTI FlexiCap Fund. We are fairly convinced that what we hold in our portfolio are great businesses. We now have to show the conviction of continuing to hold on to them while they may be rewarded or punished from time to time. And I think uh, we remain fairly convinced about uh, the ability of such a portfolio to create long-term shareholder value. Thank you very much for your patient listening. And uh, that's it for today. Mutual fund investments are subject to market risks. Read all scheme-related documents carefully.